Carrier is designed to lead a flotilla of vessels or operate solo while keeping enemy fleet at bay using its anti-ship missiles and using its aircraft to deter enemy aircraft. The Queen Elizabeth class on the other hand are designed to operate with a battle group to maintain air superiority, strike a variety of strategic and tactical targets using aircraft in addition to providing an air assault platform. Despite recent sensationalist tabloid headlines, describing the Admiral Kuznetsov as massive while decrying the UK's tiny ships, the Queen Elizabeth class are of a significantly higher tonnage than the Russian vessel, each sitting at 70,600 tons compared to its 55,000. That being said, size is a poor indicator of carrier capability so let's look beyond tabloid headlines. What are the basics? The Queen Elizabeth class aircraft carriers will be the largest surface warships ever constructed for the Royal Navy. The vessels will be utilized by all three branches of the UK armed forces and will provide eight acres of sovereign territory. Both ships will be versatile enough to be used for operations ranging from high intensity conflict to providing humanitarian aid and disaster relief. Surprisingly for their sheer scale each ship will only have a total crew of 679, only increasing to the full complement of 1600 when the air elements are embarked. This is made possible by extensive automation of many systems. HMS Queen Elizabeth, the first in a fleet of two, is currently preparing to begin trials with F-35 jets. The Admiral Kuznetsov serves as the flagship of the Russian Navy and is their only aircraft carrier. The initial name of the ship was Riga, she was launched as Leonid Brezhnev in 1985. She was originally commissioned in the Soviet Navy and was intended to be the lead ship of her class but the only other ship of her class, Vryag, was never completed or commissioned by the Soviet, Russian or Ukrainian Navy. This second hull was eventually sold to the People's Republic of China by Ukraine, completed in Dalian and launched as Liaoning. The Russian vessel carries a number of offensive weapons typically associated with guided missile cruisers and the carrier itself is capable of engaging surface, subsurface and airborne targets. What kind of power can they project? The Queen Elizabeth class carriers, in peacetime, will usually deploy with around 12 to 24 F-35 BS and a number of various helicopter types, 